What's going on guys, it's Shane. We're back here again with another video. Today we're going to be returning to School Bus Simulator. And as you can see, there are trees now. Thank goodness this game looked very bland without trees. Uh, even though they're low poly, it still makes the map look a lot better. So, um, along with the addition of trees, they also had some other fixes and stuff such as turn radiuses and roads and stuff like that. And uh, let's go ahead and spawn in a bus. I have no idea what to drive, to be honest with you. Um, there's just quite a bit of buses to actually choose from. Um, let's go Thomas. No. Wait, how do I go back? Okay, well, electric. Stop sign. I don't think we can actually choose, can we? I think that's a game pass option. So, uh... Yeah. Okay. So we'll start the engine here. Okay, roof color. White. Uh, fog light color, white. Update fog light. Okay. Oh, you can actually flash rate. Yeah, that's actually crazy. You can change the speed of it and everything. Well, I mean, that's cool. So the last video I did on this game, uh, I had somebody comment on the video that were kind of helping me out with why the game is the way it is. Uh, when I, what I mean by that is, you know, I kind of talked about the uh, poor builds and, you know, just kind of like the road layout and stuff. Uh, so apparently, and I kind of already knew this, but it's to help with lag. They want the game to be playable by everyone and I totally get it, but, um, I wasn't bashing the game or anything like that. It's just constructive criticism, which I give to any and all developers really. Uh, cause I'm honestly just trying to help at the end of the day, but yeah, I mean, I get it though. I mean, you know, you got the, uh, the buses with no interior, which, you know, that, that there reduces a, a lot of lag. I could tell you right now, you could, you know, you didn't have, well, you could honestly put realistic builds in here and keep the buses with no interior and you'd probably get kind of the same results, to be honest with you. To be honest with you, where am I going? Cancel route. I didn't even know I had a route. Let's do, so, oh, also the field trip. Somebody told me that the field trip was in the uh, generate route location. I didn't know that. So, uh, start at school location, start at school location. We'll do three. Okay, I guess we just go to one of these arrows. I'm sure those arrows indicate the schools. So, we'll drive to this one over here. But yeah, no, I, I totally get it though with the uh, whole low poly kind of look. You just want to make sure everybody can play it without any lag, which, you know, it works. So it's just, like I said, it's it's not the game that I'm into, you know, because I'm all about realism and that's kind of why I went on a rant about it last time. Uh, however, these roads look a lot better with the use of Archimedes there, I guess. I don't know. Some people don't use Archimedes. Some people like to go out of their way to kind of just make an actual mesh corner like that which i don't know if that was that or not because some people don't know about plugins and it's beyond me the things people do you know they go out of their way and do when there's a plugin specifically for it i remember telling somebody about roads and stuff they were like dude i've been doing these by freaking hand and stuff. i'm like no there's a plugin that'll do roads for you you know, they were in the toolbox grabbing roads and stuff. I was like, what are you doing? <laughs> oh, my God. Okay. Oh, that's not what we want to do. Is it V? Oh, what did I just do? Oh, is that a free cam? No, it kind of just... I guess it's like a cinematic camera. I don't know. Um. Okay. Headlights, I apparently turned on, but they're, there they go. Oh, they're just very dim. Yes. Okay. Light test. That's... Oh. Look at that. Okay. How do we turn on just the... 
Hmm. Okay. We'll just park here. Oh, there they are. They're running way over here. So it looks like we got some people in here. But, uh, you know, like I said, I will say this game does have some features that other buzz simulators don't have, which are uh, very nice, such as the, um, you know, passenger system here and um, this where it kind of displays their bus numbers and stuff, which is really cool because I think mine will say 2441 if I type in there, but I'm not going to. Uh, so, yeah, no, V apparently changes the view, which, I mean... Actually, it doesn't change your view. It kind of just stops your mouse from moving and stuff. But we will go ahead and head out here. Well. Why can't I? There we go. I was about to say, why can't I move? I don't know. I Because, you know, I just believe in polished Roblox games. You know, like the UI here, it's not the greatest, which... You know, I mean, I I mean, I get it, though. I mean, not a lot of people. I don't know if it's like an independent developer, which I think it might be. So if it is, I totally get it. You know, not everybody is good at everything, you know. I don't know. I don't know. Because I'm building my own bus simulator, and I'm trying to make sure it has... Uh, good features, good UI, all that stuff. I mean, so I think that's a field trip lo locate. Lo what? That is the field trip location. And then there's some other ones over here. I think the farm is one of the field trip locations. The football stadium there. And whatever is over there. We're going to go to that one, actually. Also, these stoplights don't make any sense. Uh, what? Why does it extend all the way out to this lane over here? I don't get that. That's what I don't get. I think I commented on that last time, too. Because that doesn't make any sense at all. If there's one thing I'm going to bash, it's those lights. Because that's crazy. <laughs> that is crazy. Sorry, but seriously. Right, we'll go left here. Then there's a gas station here, which I don't know if gas is a feature in this game. I actually haven't thought about that. I don't think it is. If there was, I'm sure there'd be some sort of gauge or something that would display our gas. I don't know. And you got Game Pass gifting, which is also another good feature as well that not a lot of other games have. You know, it's got its pros and cons, but mainly a lot of them are kind of just my opinions, which are only valid to myself. So, like I said, don't take any of it personal. It's just constructive criticism. We need to make a right right here. But, you know, one thing I do know is, like I said, if you replace a lot of these buildings with a little bit more of a realistic build, it, it it's not going to make it much laggier at all. It's it's really not. Um, your game, if it has under 100,000 parts, you, you're good to go. Trust me. Uh, when you start getting over that, it'll get a little more crazy, especially if you're using a lot of unions and uh, stuff like that. It's It's no good. Don't use a lot of that stuff. Okay, do not hit me, please. What is that parking job? He's got the same exact bus I do. In fact, actually, he has double stop signs, though. Oh, is this what we're doing right here? Sweet. Sweet. Oh, he's driving like a North Carolina-style bus. How do you put your ambers on? I'm pressing V, but I don't think... 
I have no idea. Okay, I need to get a good screenshot here. That'll work. Oh, looks good. Look at look at the uh, headlight difference. He's got a uh, what do you call those headlights? The halogen or something like that. I don't really know. But uh, we have uh, I don't know anything about headlights, honestly. Who's this? I think I know you. I'm sure you do. I'm sure you do. Why is my name green? Why is my word green? What the heck? Why am I 113? And why am I invisible? What? What? Well, I have so many questions. My goodness. Okay. Well, that was kind of our little updated video on this game. Um... The addition of trees were a great, you know, a thing. Um, like I said, the trees were kind of my biggest thing. You know, all maps need trees. There is not a single place you live where there aren't any trees, okay? Unless you live out in the uh, the valley or something. Um, but, uh, yeah, if you guys do want to play the game yourself, it will be linked in the description down below. If you guys liked the video, please leave a like and subscribe. And uh, I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.